Hey YouTube, welcome back to my channel. It's Nicole here. If you're new to my channel, make sure you subscribe. Welcome, good to see you. And if you already subscribed to my channel, thanks for coming back and tuning in to another video. Today I'm going to share with you the items that I got at my first baby shower. I'm having another baby shower a week from now, so I'll be filming another video separately showing you the items that I'll receive from that baby shower. But in today's video, I'm going to show you all of the items that I got at my baby shower that was on January 26th. And I got way more items than I would have ever imagined. So this may be a long video. However, I also wanted to say if you came to my baby shower and bought a gift, or if you were unable to attend and you sent the gift via mail, thank you so much. I really appreciate it. It meant so much to me for um, so many people to come out and support and show um, baby care again love um, as she is welcomed into this world. Don't forget, you can follow me on Instagram at Nicole the Scientist because I did post quite a few photos from the baby shower. So make sure you follow me on Instagram so you can see some of those photos that I took at the baby shower. And if you're interested in seeing all of the items that I received for my baby girl, then make sure you stick around for this video. So I pretty much have all of the larger items on the floor, and then I'm going to do the clothes separately and I'm going to do the blankets separately. So first and foremost, I'm going to start on this side and show you some of these um, larger items because I really wanted to get this video out before I started to get things organized in her nursery because there are a lot of items and I, I do want to get some of these items put away before I have my second baby shower for my Pittsburgh family. Um, in a week from now because I do think I'll probably get a lot more items as well. So I'm going to try to get this nursery organized and show you guys these items before things get too chaotic in here and I get a little bit too big and don't feel like um, doing anything. So I tried to put everything together like in the same category. So I did get quite a few um, bath essentials for the baby. I thought this was really cute. This is a Johnson & Johnson's um, baby bath kit, but it also has this cute little elephant sprout you can put on the faucet and it makes the shower gel foam. So I thought this was really cute. And it has the lotion, shampoo, bubble bath, destin ointment, and some baby cleansing wipes. Also got this little bubble bath set as well. I thought this was really nice because um, this is a different set th than the other one I just showed you. This is supposed to be for nighttime, bedtime calming, giving the baby calm at night. So I'll definitely be using this. It's called the Sleepy Time Baby Bath Gift Set. And then here I got the traditional baby bath set. So it looks like the baby will be set for a while with lotions and bubble bath, which is really good because I do plan on giving her baths quite often. I want her to smell good and be clean every day, so we'll definitely be making use of all of the bath items. I was also excited to get these draft products. This stuff smells so good. I did get the baby draft Stage 1 Newborn Laundry Detergent. And I hear these smell amazing. These are the Blissful Scent Fabric Softener Beads. I'll definitely be using these so her clothes are smelling really good. And I've got two of these, which they definitely will be coming in handy. These are the stain removers. So I guess, you know, babies spit up a lot and they tend to get their clothes dirty quite a bit. So I'll definitely be making sure I use these to get rid of stains. <clears throat> also, speaking of 
body wash and soap. I did get this little travel pack, which is very nice because I do see myself um, and my husband traveling a lot with the baby. So this will be nice to have like a smaller version of the Johnson & Johnson um, lotion, shampoo, wipes, and dust and creams. So this is the actual travel kit. Travel kit. This was on my registry on Amazon. Um, I do have quite a bit of clothes for the baby so far, but they're um, different sizes. So, you know, the closet is getting pretty full. So I was actually running out of hangers. So I put these on my registry. Thankfully, one of my um, cousins, my family members, purchased this for me. These are the premium pink baby hangers. And um, I did get these from Amazon as a baby shower gift. So my best friend did pick up this item off my Target registry. This is the Boppy pillow and I do look forward to using this pillow. Um, I do plan on using this for breastfeeding. I probably will take this to the hospital with me. Um, however, I do plan on primarily pumping so even if I don't end up breastfeeding and I'm just using the, the breast milk from pumping, this will still be nice to like lay the baby on and feed them, feed her, her bottle, you know, so she can be really comfortable and it will also give me some support too. And then, you know, you can also do a lot of things with these bobby pillows. The baby can lay on it, play on it, sit on it, so... This is a very versatile item, and I really did want this item, so I'm glad I was able to get this off my Target registry. This item right here, my husband actually seen when we were in Target, and he suggested that we have this. So I think this will come in um, handy um, if we're in the bed watching TV or if we're on the couch. This will be really nice to let the baby lay in, take a nap. Just give her a little time to relax, and she'll be protected. We don't have to worry about her rolling off the couch or rolling off the bed. This is called the Snuggle Nest Dream, and this was also on my Target registry. So my mom did get this item for me from Walmart. It was not on my registry because she had already um, committed to buying this, so it wasn't a need for me to put it on the registry. She did purchase this from Walmart. This is the Graco Travel Light Crib, and there's a photo of it on top, if you can see. It's a pack and play, but it's also a bassinet. It's good for traveling. It's lightweight, and it's a little bit smaller than the traditional pack and play, so you can set this up in the house. Um, if you travel, you go into a hotel for a night stay, this is really good. You can also take it on an airplane with you because it comes wrapped up in a nice, convenient package. So this is the Great Coat Travel Light Crib. Also from my Amazon registry, my cousin was very nice enough and generous enough to order me my breast pump bag for going back to work. This has two openings on the sides here, one for the pump, one for the cooler for your breast milk. And it's nice and sleek for work and it has an insert inside for your laptop. So this is a really nice breast pump bag that was on my Amazon registry that I did get. And it's really beautiful. I may end up even doing a separate review on um, breast pumping and how it's working for me um, once I am back to work after my maternity leave. I may do a separate video to um, showcase all of the features of this bag and what this bag has to offer. So I'm really looking forward to using this. And then it can also probably be used as a diaper bag as well. I did get this cute Minnie Mouse diaper bag. You can never have too many diaper bags. Um, I know that they get dirty. You're always going to need something to put the baby's items in. So this will definitely come in handy. And it also has the little bottle 
carrier attached and it's insulated. So let's go on this side, see what items over here. This was on my register as well. This is just a general 4-in-1 convertible baby carrier. Um, I'm not really into the wraps. I think they're a little bit complicated. So I see myself just being able to snap and do a couple of clicks and secure the baby opposed to doing all of the wrapping with those wraps. They look a little bit complicated to me. So... I will definitely be making use of this, probably more so around the house. If I'm doing things, I can just pop the baby right on my chest and get moving and get things done around the house. And I did get this from Target as well. One of my favorite items is my diaper bag that I had on Amazon. I did register for this bag. It's a very nice quality diaper bag. It comes with a changing pad and it has additional straps, but there's plenty of room and space and storage for bottles. It has a lot of zippies on the outside and the sides. You have a side pocket here for easy access to baby wipes. And I really wanted to get something that wasn't super girly so that if my husband has to grab this and go somewhere, it won't be something too feminine for him. So I think this will work out perfect for us as a diaper bag. I did receive this cute pink basket. And I received some breast, some um, breast pumping items, ancillary items that I needed to accompany my breast pump that I ordered through my insurance. So I did get two packs of these. Medela breast milk storage bags. So it's 50 in each pack. I'm not sure how many I'll need, but I'm assuming I'll need quite a bit if I'm if I plan on pumping for a while. And I did have some test samples of these, and I really like the quality of these over the um, Lancelin brand. So I'm really looking forward to using these for breast milk storage. And I did have these on my Target registry. Also, on my Target registry, I was happy to receive this item. This is the cooler bag with four little breast pump containers. And these match with my Medela breast pump. And this little cooler also fits in that breast pump bag that I showed you pretty nicely. And it also has a ice pack and it fits four little cooler bottles and that item was also on my gift registry on my Amazon registry as well I have this um, three stage um, waist belt for recovery postpartum recovery so I'll let you ladies know how I like this, but it has three parts to it. These are pretty popular on YouTube. I've seen quite a few reviews on this item. This was on my Amazon registry, and it actually had quite quite a few um, good reviews. So I'm looking forward to trying this um, immediately after I have the baby to have some support down there. Um, Hopefully, I don't have to have a C-section, but if I do have to have a C-section, th this will come in handy for that, as well as if I have natural birth for helping my uterus um, contract back. So this was another really nice item that was on my registry that I did get as a gift. So I did get this really cute basket that I will be using in her room. It matches her room and her color scheme perfectly so I'll probably end up putting this somewhere on her changing table but a few of the items that I get in here um, I did get some packs of bibs which babies will always need bibs I feel like they'll always get dirty I did get some birth cloths and it says thank heavens for little girls 
some cute little washcloths from Target. And my friend actually got me this little outfit for first photo shoot. It's a little Minnie Mouse outfit with a matching hat and a little skirt and a little booties. So I'll be taking a photo of her in this while she's pretty young. I'll be using my um, iPhone XR portrait mode because that's a really nice camera. I did get two packs of towels, baby towels. You can never have enough of those, I'm assuming. These will definitely come in handy. I got a little teddy bear that says my first bear, which is really cute, and it rattles. And I have this little soft little blankie. It's extremely soft. It's a little bunny. And I also have some little baby minutes to protect her from scratching her face. Next in this bag, my um, mother-in-law did pick up the monitor for me off of my Target registry. This is the VTech baby monitor. And it was $100, and it has um, the two-way talk. It has lullabies and sounds. It has a temperature sensor and a high-resolution 5-inch LCD screen. And I believe it goes up to... 2,000 feet in range But let me know if you if you ladies that are expecting if you want to have a review on this monitor Let me know I can yeah, let you guys know how I like this monitor. Oh, it goes up to a thousand feet in range So I'm really looking forward to being able to have this monitor um, I do plan on her sleeping in her room um, When she comes home from the hospital our bedroom is literally like inches away right next door so this would be nice to have a peace of mind to know that she's doing okay in her crib while she's sleeping also at my baby shower we were supposed to play this little baby doll game where you see who can get baby dressed the fastest so my mom's friend close friend Purchased the Baby Alive doll, which we were going to use, which also was going to be a gift for Kerrigan. So this is her first little doll. Look how cute she is. And I think my baby is going to look like this little doll, so we'll see. But this is the Baby Alive doll. She has little pampers, and she has little baby food. And this will be Kerrigan's first doll. So I'm going to find somewhere to put her in a nursery um, because she's too cute to just put away in storage. <laughs> also, I did receive two packs of the four ounce bottles of the Dr. Brown's bottles, which are great. I do think I would prefer using the little bottles, the four ounce bottles while she's little when I'm feeding her. So these will definitely um, come in handy for me. While she's really little and while she's not really drinking a lot of milk. So I got the pink ones and I also got the blue and white ones. Also, which was very great with these, I got the little um, Dr. Brown six months nipple nipples. Because I guess once they get to a certain age, they need like better milk flow so you have to switch out the nipples so these will definitely come in handy as well i got two packs of pacifiers and what i do like about these these actually glow in the dark so i'm looking forward to actually using these i think that's really cool that these glow in the dark i received two sippy cups so dr brown's little pink sippy cup 
And this cute little Minnie Mouse sippy cup I did have on my Amazon registry. I thought this was just super cute. Also on my registry, I put some pacifier clips to attach to the baby's clothes so that, they, you know, if they spit the pacifier out, it won't just go on the floor. I really don't like the idea of her pacifier flying somewhere on the floor under the seat of the car, and then it's dirty, and then, you know, you a lot of people, like, put the pacifier in the mouth and clean it. I don't like that, so I'm really... I'm looking forward to using these to keep her pacifiers attached to her clothes so that if she does spit it out, it won't go flying on the floor anywhere. Also, I got this little soothing pacifier teether. I'm sure that'll come in handy for her once she starts teething. And I also put this little fancy rinse cup on my registry for bath time. Next up in this bag, I put a lot of the toys and teethers in there. Um, and I want to show you guys all of the little toys and stuff that she did receive. I did receive this little baby, bro um, baby bottle brush holder. It um, suctions and sits on the countertop for easy access for washing bottles. So this will be a nice item to have. This is one of my favorite items. I actually have this on my Amazon registry. It's a baby rattle set box, and it contains a bunch of little rattle toys and teethers for her to play with. And they're all like this really cute pink and turquoise color. So there's several little baby items in here, little toys. So this is like her little first little toy box. Good to have items that stimulate the baby's brain, even when they're really little. So, this is her little toy box, and like I said, this was on my Target registry. I'm really looking forward to her playing with these toys. My cousin purchased us several books. I got books for my cousin, which I am looking forward to having some learning time with her as she gets older. There's six little mini books. How cute is that? This is for nouns because I really want my baby to be smart, and I'm sure she will be because her and her daddy were very smart people. Nursery rhymes and very first words. So we're going to get started very early diving into these books. So I'm really appreciative of those books. We have this really cute little eat, eating set. Spill proof baby plate. So it has a little plate and it has little sections. So this is really cute for when she started eating whole foods. And it suctions so it doesn't go flying everywhere. It's a cute little VTech phone. How cute is this little phone? Six months and older, but she'll probably start playing with this sooner. I got three of the same teething rings, however it's okay because I can like leave one at grandparents' house, one in a car, one in the diaper bag, one at home. So these are some nice little teethers. You can put them in the cooler and um, have them to cool and then they'll put them on their teeth. So these will definitely come in handy when she starts teething. got another little rattle toy here super cute and I did get a little safety first kit hairbrush and comb she has this little toy set they're connecting rings you can connect baby toys to them and just it'll just all around keep her busy they're just little connector rings. Really cute. Before I go ahead and show you the clothes, I meant to show you 
my car gear that I received. I did have these items on my Target registry and Bruce's friends were nice enough to come through with these gifts. So Bruce recently purchased us a new truck for the baby so that we can have adequate space for when we have family in, time, in town and when we have my stepson. So these will be really nice to put on the windows to block the sun from the baby. My eyes are very sensitive to the sun, so I'm assuming my baby, she probably would not like the sun just beaming in her face. So this is a two-pack of the um, roller shades. I did get these from Target. And this also was on my registry, which I think will come in handy. So you can put this on the seat before you put your car seat on there. And if they happen to spill things, it'll more than likely go onto the little mat and it's easy to clean. And it'll just pretty much protect your seat if your baby's back there throwing juice and throwing crackers everywhere. And this is the Elite Guardian car seat cover. So I'm really looking forward to using this. Actually, um, Bruce and I are supposed to be installing the car seat today. So um, if we make it out there before it gets cold, then we'll put this on and install her car seat. We did receive a ton of onesies and t-shirts um, from the baby shower, which I'm very grateful for. She will definitely be utilizing all of these items. So first up, we have this cute little sweater. I tend to get cold quickly, so this will be nice to have if we're indoors somewhere. I can just throw over her outfit, whatever she's wearing, and it's gray, so it'll match pretty much any outfit that she has on at the time. We did receive this cute um, baby robe here. Little goldfish and little booties to put her feet in, keep her warm. I thought this was really cute. I got this really cute unicorn blue newborn onesie, which I absolutely love. Look how cute these are, the little unicorns on the feet. got another little newborn set here and it says some bunny loves me and has little bunnies on it this is so cute and this has a little t-shirt with the matching pants and then on this side it has the little onesie here the little newborn onesie another cute little newborn onesie with the pink flowers Another little outfit set in newborn. It says the snuggle is real. It has a little elephant on the butt. And it has two t-shirts. A gray polka dot short sleeve and this pink long sleeve shirt as well. Now for the three month stuff. We have cute another cute little onesie. I love the zip ups. They seem like they'll be really convenient. Um, especially for um, at nighttime for changing pampers and just zip and go. We have another unicorn outfit in the three months. It has the onesie back here, and then in the front, it has the matching pants and t shirt to keep her little feet warm. We have this cute little rainbow dinosaur unicorn onesie here. That's just really cute. You can see the little sleeves here. Three to six months. Glitter hearts. Little teddy bear. Zip up onesie. Very cute. Little happy onesie. Little jumpsuit. Six months. I thought that's really cute. She has also a little summer outfit here that she can wear. It's a little onesie set. We have another little unicorn pink onesie with the buttons and the unicorns on the feet. This is size six to nine months. So as you can see, I really appreciated that a lot of people got different sizes and not everything just like newborn in three months so 
everything is spread out as far as sizing. So I'm pretty sure she'll be able to utilize everything and get to wear everything. I have a cute little outfit here, six to nine months. Another little nine month outfit that has these really cute socks and the matching hat. With butterflies on it. We even have some 18 month items. Look how cute this little outfit is. Full of happy. Love this little outfit. And then for 18 months as well, we have this little Hello Kitty with the little go hearts on the leggings. So cute. And then we did get some t-shirts. We have these in three months. They say mommy plus me. And they just have some different prints and designs. And I also got the same pack in six months. And I also have these in six months. Some little bunnies on there. Different colors. Very cute shirts. And then I even have some 12 months t-shirts. Last but not least, I want to show you all of the blankets that she received. Um, she will be born in March in the spring. However, it's still going to be cold here because we do live on the East Coast. So these blankets will definitely um, get utilized. I received this pack of receiving blankets here. This soft, cute little gray and pink blanket. This little cute blanket with the hearts and the matching comfort. Little um, bear blanket. This was my favorite blanket. I had this on my Amazon registry, and I'm so glad that um, I was able to get it off my registry. It's super soft, and it's just like a floral print plush blanket. Also received this blanket as a gift, and it's very soft in the inside here, and it seems like very luxurious. I got this cute little pink blanket with the lamb that says baby. Very nice and soft. And also this was another blanket that was on my registry. And then I received this a classic pink blanket with the satin trim. And I did get this swaddle blanket from my registry off Amazon. My friend did pick this up for me. And this is the um, swaddle blanket with the matching headband that I do plan on bringing to the hospital for her to take her first photos in. And it's super pretty. I'm going to open it and show you guys how it looks. So this is the swaddle blanket. It's really nice stretchy material for swaddling. And then it has the matching little headband. So she'll put this on her head to match the blanket. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, thanks for watching. I know it was kind of long, but I got so many items and I wanted to show you all everything that I received and let you guys know how much love we received from the baby shower. And just wanted to show you guys all of the cool stuff that she got. If you enjoyed this video, make sure you give it a thumbs up. Make sure you follow me on Instagram at Nicole the Scientist. Also, stay tuned because I will be having a second baby shower for my Pittsburgh family. And I'm sure she's going to get even more items and I'm going to share those items with you as well. So make sure you stay tuned for that. Hope you enjoyed this video. I'll see you in my next video. Bye.